Hello, Cancer. I hope you guys are doing awesome wherever you are. Happy Friday. Friday is here. So, um, Cancer, you want to do a soulmate reading to check up on the latest energies between you and your soulmate. That's what we're going to do, whether you're currently in contact with them or not. Also, whether it's your past soulmate, current soulmate, or new soulmate you're interested in, whoever it is, Whoever it is you're thinking of while watching this video, we're going to see what's going on with them and how they are relating to you at this time. So let's do this. Universe, please step in, show very clear and important messages for the sign of Cancer. For Cancer's highest good, please. Universe, what's coming towards Cancer? What will Cancer be dealing with facing? And how is Cancer currently doing on this soulmate journey they are on? One extra wants to come out. You so badly want to communicate with your soulmate, but you're not reaching out to them because the sword is pointing south instead of north. Uh, the light reflecting off of the sword shows that you have a lot you want to express, but you're holding yourself back. You're not reaching out to your soulmate at this time. This is you holding back communication, but wanting so much to talk to them, to express everything that you feel, think, plan. You want a new beginning with this person. You want to take a leap of faith and reach out to them, but you're restraining yourself. You're holding yourself back because you love this person. That's why you want to communicate with them. You love them. This is you. You want a new beginning with this person in love yeah you see two of cups you feel extremely connected with them spiritually and emotionally yeah you're holding it back you you're not reaching out this is you trying to be strong um this is you feeling like you don't have this connection with anybody else you don't think you will but you could you never know because we have many soulmates out there, but you feel this person is for you. Let's see the extra card. Yeah, you want to reconcile with this person. So you want to reconcile with them because you love them. You're very connected with them. Let's see more. Let me put the light on because I don't think there's enough light in here. Okay, let's see more. Universe, please show us. How is Cancer doing? What's coming up for Cancer? And how is Cancer doing on this soulmate journey they are on? You see, you love this person a lot. Queen of Cups, unexpressed love. So whether you're male or female, we reading energy. It shows that you're holding back, uh, that you love them. You're not expressing it to them. Yeah, you view them as marriage material, a lifetime commitment that you wanted to have with them. Yeah, you're not sure how you feel, uh, how they feel about you at this time. This is you trying to figure out how they would possibly react if you reached out to them and show them that you are emotionally attached to them, that you care for them, you love them. This is you feeling unsure. You're not sure if they love you or not. This is you, yeah, this is you protecting your heart, very guarded emotionally, not wanting to get hurt just in case they don't share the same feelings. You don't want to get hurt. This is you holding back communication. Yeah, you want so badly to communicate with them, but you're not reaching out again. This is you quiet. So it shows clearly that the two of you were in matrimony in some of the other lifetimes you shared in the past. Yeah, this is you not knowing if they love you or not. This is you questioning whether they love you or not. You're not sure. This is you checking up on them. So uh, this is you keeping tabs on them, curious how they're doing, what's going on in their life. Wow, this is heavy-duty connection you have with this person emotionally and spiritually. They could be any astrological sign whatsoever. Let's see judgment. This is you hoping, wishing to reconcile with this person. Universe, please show us uh, how is Cancer doing currently on this soulmate journey they are on? Wow, you really love this person a lot. 
King of Cups, unexpressed love, secret love. That's why you want to reconcile with them because you love them. Yeah, you see, you would like to offer some kind of emotional gesture, but you are holding back right now. Yeah, you see, you're not sure how they feel about you. Yeah, you see, this is you wondering if you reached out to them, if they would turn away from you or tell you no. This is you being concerned about that, about their reaction if you communicate with them. Yeah, you see, I just looked on the bottom of the deck. Here it shows five of cups. This is you sad, uh, regretful, heartbroken, thinking about what could have been, crying over spilled milk, sort of speak, uh, dwelling on the past, feeling like it's over, like it's the end. Yeah, this is you uncertain what to do, whether to reach out or not. Stand still at a crossroads, not making a decision right now. You feel enormous connection with this person. Lovers, past life connection with this person. Universe, please show us very important messages for Cancer's highest good, please. Universe, the soulmate of Cancer, the soulmate of Cancer. What is going on with the soulmate of Cancer? How is the soulmate of Cancer doing? And how are they towards Cancer? This one wants to come out very strongly as extra message. Let's see, Cancerians. This person also feels the need for communication. Yeah, this person feels a great need for communication, clarity between the two of you. This person is heavily concentrating on business, finances, income, job. They're not reaching out. They feel heartbroken. This is them feeling heartbroken, unable to see clearly what they need to do. They feel blocked in this connection at this time. Yeah, you see, they feel that there was a major disconnection between you two, a breakup. You see the tower with eight of swords. Let me see the extra message. Temperance. A lot of you are dealing with Sagittarius, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Virgo. Well, all signs are showing up. Leo, Aries, all signs are showing up. But this specifically talks of uh, uh, Sagittarius because this is a major arcana for Sagittarius. Let me see. Universe, please show us. So this person has been waiting patiently to figure out where this is going. This is patience, temperance. Universe, please show us. What's going on with the soulmate of cancer? And how is the soulmate of cancer towards cancer? So this has been in and out connection. Um, yeah, in and out connection. This person is checking up on you uh, through videos like this, social media, mutual acquaintances. This person is checking up on you. Some of them have the capability to check up on you through your job or business. Yeah, this person feels they met you for a reason, like this was a significant meeting. This is them being quiet right now. Um, they have very high standards for themselves. Major changes going on with them in their life. They are making major changes in their life, going through a lot. This is them thinking that maybe you don't want to hear from them. They would like to clear the air with you, though. Yeah, they feel like they this is unsettled between you two. Like they would like to clear the air. A lot of you are dealing with uh, Scorpio, Taurus, Gemini, Leo. Let's see over here. Universe, please show us how is the soulmate of Cancer doing? And how is... The soulmate of cancer towards cancer. See, they waiting patiently for communication. So they either waiting for the right time to communicate with you or waiting for you to communicate with them. See, this is them trying to make wise decision whether to let go or to reach out or to wait for communication. Yeah. This person still cares for you emotionally because cups are showing up here. They still feel 
attached to you emotionally but are quiet at this time and are wondering if you're going to reach out to them if you care about them um, Cancerians, we're going to go into your extended reading and ask about your soulmate's true long-term intentions and plans for you at this time. Then we're going to ask what they're hiding from you at this time, whether they're hiding it on purpose or can't communicate for whatever reason, but the universe feels you need to be aware of for your highest good. And of course, at the end, we're going to ask advice for you on how to best handle the soulmate connection at this time and anything else you need to know about your life, whether it's your health, finances, business, job opportunities, family matters, friendships, whatever it is you need to know, they'll show it at the end of the reading as well. So Cancer, click on the extended link below this video in the description box below and I'll see you there.